Constance Carter. I want to talk to you today about disputing a debt. There's different ways you can dispute a debt. There's the regular way. Most of you know how to dispute a debt. Dispute a debt. You can do it in writing, online, or over the phone. The best way to dispute a debt is actually in writing. If you dispute the debt online, there are arbitration clauses. When you hit accept, there are arbit arbitration clauses on there that prevent you from pursuing them in any lawsuits or if anything goes awry. However, going a step further, a lot of people will just dispute everything. Good, bad, I, just, I get credit reports, I'll pull credit reports and there's a dispute on everything. And it's like, why are you disputing everything? They just do what I call the spray and pray method. You don't wanna do that. Um, you really wanna be uh, very specific with how you dispute things and I talk about it in my book, Keeping Score, what you need to know to make your credit score grow. But here's a secret weapon that most of you don't know or most people don't know and a lot of credit repair companies, they use this method that they don't tell a whole lot of people about and it's about debt validation, validating the debt. And the reason why it's so important is because these collection agencies, they will get a bunch of, they'll buy a bunch of collections from a, um, a collector or creditor and they'll pay 10 cents on the dollar for them and then they'll just start collection efforts. Um, they'll call your job, they'll call your home, your, your home and they have no proof that you actually own this debt. And sometimes when you do own the debt, they still have no proof. And so what you need to do is you need to send them this letter in writing and it's in my book, Keeping Score. Basically what you're saying is, show me proof that I actually owe this debt. You need to validate four items, okay? Proof that the collection agency actually owns the debt. They have to prove to you that they own this debt. Number two, a copy of the statement from the original creditor showing the amount and the complete history. If they cannot prove or cannot provide you a statement from the original creditor showing the amount and the complete payment history. Number three, a copy of the original signed loan agreement or credit card application. And then number four, a copy of a canceled check from you to the original creditor. Nine times out of 10, these collection agencies cannot prove any of these four items. And so what happens is if they can, if you ask them to validate the debt, they do not validate the debt in writing within 30 days you can pursue, you can go after them and they can be fined a thousand dollars, okay? So this is something that's very important that you should know is that these collection agencies, there's a lot of rogue collection agencies out there that are collecting on debts that they have no right to collect on and all you have to do is ask them to validate the debt. All right, hopefully this helps. Any questions, get the book, Keeping Score. There's more information in here regarding debt validation what you need to know to make your credit score grow. Take care, God bless, peace.